Hello everyone, welcome back to these pivot videos. As I have said the past couple of videos, I will be dedicating these next couple of weeks to the Olympics in Sochi. And I have found an interesting article that I'm sure a lot of people, because you are from Ukraine, uh, will enjoy this article of national pride, I hope. So at this point, please post this video. It's just a fast little article that uh, I just wanted to share with you all if you haven't been keeping up with what's happening in the Olympics. So please pause this video right now. So as you can see in the article, it is about the bronze Olympian for Ukraine, Vitas Maryenko, who won it in the sprint race early, very early on uh, in the Olympics. And I just wanted to kind of throw in uh, some stuff about Ukraine and Ukraine's athletes, and uh, I think everybody should be proud of her for representing the country and winning bronze. I also would like to say that today I was watching um, uh, figure skating, and they had some athletes who were representing Ukraine, but they were both from the USA who ended up getting Ukrainian citizenship just for the Olympics. And I would like to point out that I think that that is wrong. I think that people who are in the Olympics should represent their home country, not not just trying to get into the Olympics and competing for a country. I think if, if you're Ukrainian and you compete, you should compete for your country. If you're an American, you were born in America, and you compete for America, that's one thing. If, you, if you're if you Ukrainian, with Ukrainian pride, support your home country. I don't think it's right that athletes are going to other countries just so that they can get a spot in the Olympics. That's just my opinion. But as I said, I hopefully there are more medals along the way for the Ukrainian national team. And hopefully you enjoyed this article. If you have any questions, please let me, Teresa Orina, know. And thank you for watching. Go Ukraine. <laughs>